Well, everybody went crazy to begin with. They started to use reds, blues, greens. I was, I did the same thing. I remember one time I was painted a set pink, and everybody, the cameraman, almost killed me, uh, because, you know, you you think, well, it got color. Now I can finally make a statement. That's the worst thing you can think of. It, and in my viewpoint, a set should never attract, detract from, or be a point of attention over the the acting or the people or the story. You know, you don't want to detract from the, the story. It's like putting striped wallpaper they used to do and they jump the lines and you'd be looking at somebody and the wallpaper's doing a dance behind them. You think, my God, it spoils the scene, you know. So they had to hire a special guy from, called Bob Brower from uh, the network to put a lid on it. You know, censor the uh, art directors. Who hired him? The, the studio or the network. Mm -hmm. Because they were going crazy. And, uh, you know, he solidified it. What was his position? How did he? He had complete authority. Mm -hmm. that if he walked in and he didn't like it, you had to change it. So he would go from set to set? And... Yeah, he hung around. Mm -hmm. How long did that last? Well, it lasted about a year, I think, probably before they got it, you know, where they standardized it. Do you remember anything he said to you about something you had He was done? a good buddy of mine. I, I used him as a friend, and he was very helpful in color selections. And, you know, he'd take color upholstery and, and uh, swatches, and, and also you need costume swatches. So you don't want to have the costumes blend in with the net or the background. And, you know, you had to know the colors of costumes and things. I'm talking about a more sophisticated situation, but es essentially it all has to be coordinated and you can make some terrible mistakes if you're not, you know, conscious of who's doing what and how they're doing it. So more in color than in black and white did you have to start being concerned about costumes? Black and white is fairly simple because they used to have in fact, in fact, most of the early sets were just painted in black and white. And they had uh, like one, two, three, and four on the value value of the color, which means the shade of it. And if you had a color, you knew its value, you know? It's a two or a three. It's what it would be in black and white, although it was in color. You really have to know the value of it. And uh, it... Uh, but they had it down to a science at the major studios, and then of course that all went to hell when they, they went into color and had to start getting new standards like for it.